this is Osmond Gaming, and it has been a really long time since I've done stuff. Like, I know it's like, you guys have your, like, ah, oh, you get stuff every day and whatnot, but... Ah, oh, man, it's been such a long time, because I pretty much had, like, all the episodes done f from, like, Tuesday or Monday. And, uh... Yeah, lots of stuff has just happened. And, well, it's been about a week... I mean, it's Sunday, and it's pretty much the latest recording session I have ever done, so... It's, it's, it's a hefty load. Am I even going in the right direction? I remember Melancholy Moors, but... Yeah. Yep, I'm not in the right direction. Oh, treasure. Nice. Oh, that HP is gonna be handy. Thank you. Okay, so... Alright, so... Hammerstone Gorge. That's probably where we need to be. I mean, we're gonna go to dwarves and we're gonna disguise ourselves. I mean, like, why else wouldn't we? I mean, we're at a little, like, Halloween party or something, eh? I mean, we're gonna get the drinks, and they're gonna, the punch is gonna be spiked with even more punch. It's gonna be, like, so much punch, like, no one can believe how much punch there is. I mean, it's, like, gonna be, like, fruit punch mixed with, like, orange punch. Like, whoa! I mean, I, I can't handle that. What was I saying? Am I even going in the right direction? Like, let's see. It says something. It says something about going this way. And Melancholy Moors is not there. Huh. Okay, I guess I'm going in the right direction. It says I, I go there and I go there. But yeah, like, I'm actually kind of curious. What was the longest, like, marathon of anything you've watched? So far, I have watched literally the entire Game Grumps. Well, not all of it. I'm on like part 100 of Pokemon Fire Red with the Game Grumps. And it took me until about episode 60 for me to be like, you know what, I'm gonna join them in the Pokemon adventure. I'm gonna play Pokemon. And, uh, yeah. And, like, watching it made me super stupid. Stupid, like uncontrollably, like I've got, I've had, I've, I'll, I'll just share like the Pokemon that I have gotten and their names. My personal favorite is I got a a Geo dude that I named Geometry, the study of rocks and whatnot. I don't know, I never took that class, but I mean, I should sophomore. They say there's going to be algebra, which is weird because, I mean, it's the study of rocks. I mean, like, are you going to uh, use uh, repeat the Pythagorean theorem to decide how old it is? I've also named an Ekans, Ekansnometry. Or Ekansomy, or... Man, it's been a while. Then, what? It's all 14, right? Oh. Uh, ooh, yeah. Yes, it's fortunate. And, let's see, I've had a, other fun ones that I might have forgotten. I mean, like, it took me a while to get stupid. Uh, like, at first I was naming Pokemon, like, trying to be goofy, like, Oh, it's Oshelot, ha ha ha, but then, I, I totally embraced the stupid. But, yeah. I also tried to do the Nuzlocke challenge with it, and for those of you that don't know what the Nuzlocke challenge is, it is a pain, essentially. How many, how many do I need? 17? 17? Where did that minion relic go? I mean, like, there's probably, like, poison somewhere. Wow. Okay, but... Yeah, it was it was interesting having Pokemon and doing the Nuzlocke challenge because like the first time I've tried it was with the fifth generation. I was I picked Oshawa, did did Oshelot, and then I ended up kind of going from like bigger, better names. It was eh, I had a fun time, and I need green minion. Well then. I'm doing perfectly right now. I'm trying to think what other good ones I had. Like, I had Raddus. Like... 
brother of Kakarot. And wouldn't you believe it was a Raditat. But that was like for Heart Gold, that's what came next. Then after I did um Radith or after fifth gen, I can't keep my Pokemon straight. I I just got really stupid. Thanks, Grumps. Anyway. I mean I don't there's like something about how the game grumps play Pokemon that makes you lose knowledge in some way. Like Turd Snacko, come on. Turd Snacko is awesome, but still, it's like that stuff gets on you when you watch it for a thousand hours and no like, like doing stuff like ah, oh, it's just an estimation. No, it's literally thousands of hours of grumps. There's only so much a man can handle before he goes a little psycho bonkers. I mean, like, it's, it's fantastic. It's just, it wears on the brain. I haven't really been able to do much this weekend. But yeah, I went from black, Pokemon Black, to Pokemon Full Silver, and I loved that one because I've also been like, well, I'll save that story for another day. I just like how the pixel art is, and like the Pokemon follow you, and it's like, oh, that's cute. It's happy. And then, um, then there's like, what was I gonna say? Something. Oh, then I ended up switching over to Pokemon Fire Red, because it's like, oh, Fire Red and Fire Red, because I got really upset at the second gym leader. I think, like, I had a Pokemon that I named Newt Newt, like that toucan thing from the Grumps. They've mentioned it a couple times. It's just the Newt Newt bird. I don't really know anything about it. I don't think I even spelled it right. But yeah, it wasn't even like a toucan. It was just an owl. I was... I was very uh, good at stuff. Alright, while you guys are just here, I'm gonna have you guys take care of that. But while they are getting literally torn apart, I will aid in the fight if I can, like that. Yeah. But, yeah, it was interesting, like, the grump doing the thing. But yeah, I thought of doing the Nuzlocke challenge. Because I, the first time I've tried it, I failed on the spot. I'll, actually, all times I failed. But yeah, I stopped with Pokemon Fire Red because all my Pokemon died and I was like, I, I just give up. Will I do the Pokemon Nuzlocke Challenge? Probably. But I'd probably just do regular runs of like, say I go with like, oh, I go with Red and do my regular run and then do all the other Pokemons and then it's like, okay, now I can do the Nuzlocke Challenges because, I mean like, doing entertainment while playing Pokemon, that that takes some serious work. And where did my green minions go? I have a minion relic wandering about, nowhere to be found. Ah man, this is I I I don't know how to feel about this anymore. I'm just like, what? I lost my minion relic. Unless I can handle 17. I don't know. Let's go back to the thing. I, w I just want to know where my other minion went. So let's go with one. Then. Darn it. Oh. There it is. Get it. Yeah, it's probably those slugs that were doing something. So, I, I don't think they ever mentioned, like, their, like, physical strength in this. Like, the, uh, I, I should probably not be doing this. Okay. But yeah, Grumps are interesting. They are a strange species of Let's Players that are magic and fantastic. I don't know. I, I, when, when you like watch the Grumps for like literally several hours at a time, I, I've been explaining this a lot. See, this is how dumb I'm getting. I, yeah, I don't know. It's weird. Let's play the weird. Actually, um, 
I'll save it for another episode. It's about 10 minutes, and I have to do this in a haste, because, yeah, I gotta do this episode real quick, just throw up a few pictures, just for, like, little kicks and giggles, like, I'm probably gonna add Geodude and Ekans when I'm talking about geometry, and Ekansami. But, yeah, the thing about, um, the Pokemon names that I already mentioned, they are definitely going to be there. Ah. When I, like, play Pokemon on the show. So, for you hardcore fans that are currently here, you guys will know about these Pokemon predictions ahead of time. So, yeah. So, it's interesting. Next episode, catch you guys later, and have a good night, you guys. I'm gonna be going to sleep soon, so, yeah. Oh yeah, I guess also today is like the day after Valentine's Day, so by the time you see this, I'm going to be eating a lot of discount candy. For those of you that have not seen my Valentine's Day video, there it is. Alright, uh, I've been a blathering mess for a long time. Catch you guys later and see ya.